are you gay or straight? Me? No, I know you. No, I'm so bad with gay. Oh, are a queen. Oh my god, are you kidding? No. <laughs> I don't know anyone anymore. Hey guys, it's Gigi. Welcome back to my channel. So today I have a special guest with me. Me? Am I the special guest? Trishy oh. the fishy. <laughs> Trishy like fishy. Trishy like fishy. Everyone's been thinking that we are either not friends or we're not talking because I, we are not collabing every single true. day. <laughs> but it's not true. Gigi's like, we're the only friends anymore and you like YouTube friends. Cheers. No one Cheers else matters. We also have Nats here who is deciding not to be present <laughs> in this moment. And of course, Hutch. I haven't done a story time in so, 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 so long, so I thought, who better to bring back the story time than the queen of story times herself, yeah. Trisha Paytas. Uh, yeah, our Uber one was a big hit. I mean, the Uber one was, it, it was a lot. Recently, something really, really traumatic happened to me. My girlfriend fainted, and I thought she died, and that's why I wanted everyone in the video, because everyone has a different side of the story. And we do have really live traumatic. footage. For you. I had my first full blown panic attack. Yeah. Have you fainted before? Yes, I have fainted. Yeah? Yeah, like and it's been early. lots of things. Not eating, being over anxious, like yes. shots. One time I got a shot, I passed out. I passed out a lot of times. That's this number's been fault. calling me like, Let me all the time. It. It's Denver. It's like been the third day in a row. Hey, it's me. <laughs> um, no, bye. I can't. I, mean, I don't even really know where to start. This is like not clickbait. This is like insane. It's the real Also, shout excited. out to Nest Camera. Send me more because I need that. <laughs> is this sponsored by them for No, I, I swear to <laughs> God. I mean, it could be. It could be, and now it will be. <laughs> What ended up happening was, and feel free to chime in. Sure. We had had a really epic weekend. We had been partying, we were out in the sun, and we honestly weren't really eating like as much as we probably should have. Like it definitely was, was just on like an one of those weekends. Diet. Was it alcohol on the liquid diet? No, it was alcohol, just alcohol was involved. Uh, sure. <laughs> it was involved, but no, it's because I just got like oral surgery, so I couldn't chew. Just, so how the story started was we were laying outside. I was sitting and Nats was laying on my lap with her head here. I was like just playing with her hair, whatever, and I was like, okay, I have to go edit in 10 minutes. I kept putting it off, I kept putting it off. Or I end up just being like, oh my god, it's been 10 minutes, so I like fling her off of me and I'm like, I'm gonna go change into sweatpants and go into work mode, like edit. No regard for my body or the fact that I'm laying down or resting or anything, you just shot the fuck oh, shit. Off. Yeah, because I was like, oh my god, I'm late. I'm one of those people that's like, okay, in eight minutes, <laughs> like, I'm gonna go do this. Yeah, Do yeah. you do that? Yes. Uh, but you could still like gently tap your girlfriend and be like, um, sweetie, I gotta get up. Or just <laughs> kindly move me, not just, yeah. So anyways, <laughs> I get up and I walk in the door and I hear her coming behind me and then all of a sudden I hear a bang. And I like look back and she's just like on the ground. I thought that she was kidding. I run up to her and this is what you're gonna see in the footage. I stood up because like I wanted to keep laying down but I was like, okay, fine, whatever, I wanted to change into sweatpants. I remember that, I stood up and then I don't remember anything except for Gigi yelling at me angry saying stop fucking around or whatever oh my god you were conscious i was like sleep paralysis i couldn't open oh. my eyes but i could feel them like going oh. girl if someone faints don't think they're kidding that should be your I first know. thought i don't know that's i just think like what are you doing on the ground but, like yours are all very tiny and that's why it pays to have some fat on you <laughs> i never pass out <laughs> I don't have to eat for days. I never faint either, honestly. I, I, I fainted once, like when I was like 15. Some people are fainters. All right, so, so uh, this is the live footage. Get into it. Okay, I'm excited. Are you gonna show this on the thing too? Yeah, yeah, I'm gonna like put it in the thing. <gasps> I'm, I'm nervous. We had just been laying out here. Yeah. I just like jet off, and then you'll see her pause here, and she goes, wait, I feel, and then you'll see her fall. Oh my God. And she's looking at me like full on, just like Aww. doe eyes, like I had just woken up. Like, I what looked is at her and on? I was mad because I was like, what? I was so tired. I did yeah, that nap. Like she Why like did she had you just wake slept. me up? I was furious. I was livid. I thought I was taking a nap. Oh and then God. I was like, wait, when did I come on the floor? You opened your eyes within a couple seconds? I couldn't oh, open my eyes even though they were like... And then when she opened her the eyes, they were like kind of glazy. So I was like, what are you doing? Stop. Like, why are you doing this? Like, like, I was freaking around. out. Like, I'm just like the worst. My 
Cobain. Gosh. The worst. Touch, on the other hand, so calm, props me up, puts my shit in a sling. Because I like, remember from fainting, she's like an overreactive mom. She was. She freaked me out more than I was freaked out. She freaked me out because I thought I was taking a nap. She was like, you just <laughs> fainted. I thought you died. Yeah, she was you like, felt you so were hard. dead. You smashed your head open. Yeah. <gasps> you, you're like having a dead. seizure. <laughs> you're dead. That like, honestly scares me. It's like petrifying. watching it, I honestly feel like you died, and I am like terrified. Well, listen to Nick. He's like so over me. Like, yeah, I went to get fucking ice and shit. And then look at the way that you give it to her, too. You're being good, though. I think you're being not too bad. Like, now? Yeah. And then I started sobbing because I realized I was on the... Now I, she like, realized she was in pain. That I was a hit We're me. We're just keep going. Yes, yes, yeah. yes. He comes back with ice, all nonchalant. Like, get, let's get this show on the road. Yeah, well, if he was a lifeguard, he gets it. He gives her a banana. This is when and I then realized she's like, it was serious. Because Nets couldn't lift her arm up to, like, put the... Oh, yeah. Her. That's when I was like, oh, we need, oh. we need a sling. Literally, at this moment, this bruise that she has on her arm right here... It was, like, the size of an egg. I ran my finger over it, mm -hmm. and it was, like, a bump. Like, it had felt like this. I would have, like, called and on, like, right away. We the moment I thought it would fall, I would no. be like... Honestly, I'm glad we didn't because I got to smoke weed. Yeah, that's very true. <laughs> Good if you're like fainted because obviously your body was lacking something. Side note, can you get weed now without a license? Because I had a license and expired. Yeah, you can get it without a license. Oh, I've walked in the weed store with you before. You were not supposed to. They were mad. I've gone to the hospital and like my senior family like did not care. They were like, I gotta go. I gotta oh, like go let Mason. Yeah. <laughs> I had it happen one time the hospital. Fainted? It was kind of a faint slash a knockout and I was in the hospital and he literally was just like, oh, I have to go let the maids in. And I was like, then he left me at the Do hospital. By myself. So, like, the fact that you were there, like, crying, bawling, like, that means, like, love. Bawling my eyes yeah, out. Yeah, like, so what would you have done differently? Do you guys need to eat more then, maybe, or what? What do you think? Like, moral of the story don't is... Don't do liquid diets. <laughs> do not do a liquid diet, no. and don't work out all day in the sun and push that yourself and dehydrate yourself. Oh. Yeah, it was like, and, and, and it was also was the week that it was, like, 110 out. degrees. Oh, yes. Yes. and working out at the same time, and it was, like, 1.30 in the afternoon. Yeah. Oh, okay. And she's so, also the not so. <laughs> That, too. That's, that makes a big difference. Very, very important note. In the story. That's a large part of it, yeah. But that's so scary. When I saw that footage, I was like, why is my first thought to make a story time? <laughs> Like, is that awful? Why did you, you know? vlog it and then what, seriously? What's fucked is that was one of my first thoughts too when I came to. I was like, I hope the Nest <laughs> cameras were working because Gigi's gonna be able to make a funny ass video. Are you being that. so serious? No, I swear no, to God. Yeah, no. What didn't make the clip was Nats hadn't like looked down at her arm yet, and she was like looking at you in the eye, and you like went over. And you were like, your bone's coming out. Oh, you were like, your bone is coming yeah. out of your arm. Baby, your bone. And then you were like, Nick, feel this. This is her bone. Oh, <laughs> like, my, oh my God. God. And that's when Nats' yeah. eyes started like, what? Like, so like, freaking. And I was like, Oh, and it wasn't shit. even her bone. To this, this day, bitch, I don't know what it was. This, this was what is was that it? firm it's, in the human body? I mean, you can still touch firm. it. Like, I'm scared. Are you sure? Do it. It's a hurt. It's still oh. like weird. Oh. Anyways, that's terrifying. That was my well, her fainting story. <laughs> but like low key, she said it was hers. No, but really though, honestly, it was super traumatic yeah, no, for me, and I won't like. Jesus I'm owning moment. that. I will always it forever was. remember that as one of the most yeah. traumatic moments of my life. I, I will that. remember it as one of your most traumatic <laughs> moments too. I feel like I have too many fainting stories. I just like too what's many. the most gnarly? The most gnarly. One. I can't believe I should say it on YouTube. Is that gnarly? It's pretty gnarly. Was it doing sex? It was no, no, oh my God. no. But it kind That'd of it would be sex related. No, there was a one boyfriend that I had like who was really in association, but it wasn't. We weren't having sex. Oh. He just like liked it. Like so we would play around, whatever. I thought it was fun to like you know pretend like you were getting like killed Choking. or whatever. Yeah. Like, yeah. So yeah. yeah, it was like kind of foreplay where it's like you like hold someone down and you like you know you pinch this part like that. And so it happened a couple times. And like yeah, he just choked me out. I literally fainted. <laughs> I was out for like an like hours. So, like I like literally what? died. Yeah. I like legit died. Like, took a nap, basically, yeah. but like forced. Yeah, and like he didn't call, but this was, I tell the story sometimes. I was 19. My dad, like, miraculously sold, sold, sold I know showed this story. up. Yeah, yeah, showed up to my apartment, took me to the hospital, and like, because my boyfriend, like, bounced because he thought he killed me or something like that. And my dad, like, miraculously, like, we didn't talk for like a year and a half, miraculously showed up and took me to the that's Jesus. hospital. No, I swear. Literally. That's what I believe, because that was like, I was like legit dead. And I was like resuscitated. Thought I like, were dead, so mm -hmm. dead. I was like legit dead. Like, when my dad found me, there was like feces around me. 
So I don't know how long I was out for. Yeah. Oh no. It was probably so shocked that that happened sometimes. Yeah. Did you wake you up or just bring you straight to the hospital? Straight to the hospital. I wasn't awake until I went into the hospital. That is. He thought I was on drugs, and I have no idea how he showed up. I swear on like everything. No idea. That's really crazy. Just random. Because we didn't talk for like a year and a half. Did he say that he was just like just felt like you needed? Yeah. He's like he just came to like look for me because we hadn't talked in like a year and a half. Yeah. That's fucking. That's like Jesus. Yeah. So and also that guy's a dick. I hope he fucking falls. Well, he actually ended up killing himself. Oh well. Oh I feel bad. Well, that's 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 <laughs> Jesus too. That's karma. Stop it. Um, it was sad, but uh, what did he say? Like after, like yo, by the way, I'm alive. Yeah, no, he like legit blocked my number, everything. Like this. What? Is, yeah, like yeah. no, for real, hundred percent. I'll speed. tell you. Yeah, he was like he was like in a band and shit. Like he like bounced. All right, so that was my story time video on the time my girlfriend fainted, <laughs> aka one of the most traumatic times in my life. Thank you, Trisha, Yay. for being here on my channel. Thank you for having me. You guys know the drill. Until I see you guys next time, stay gorgeous. Oh, I love that you, I love that you guys all know. <laughs> <laughs>